morning. Welcome back to another vlog. Happy Here. Sunday. Like, now I have to redo that. Sorry, annoying. You're annoying. As I was trying to say, welcome back to another vlog. It's Sunday. We're gonna do a whole day in the life vlog because it's the last full week of me being here. Now we're going to get coffee. So excited. They ha it's a cute little drive through thing. I'll show you. They're popping up all around here. They're everywhere. Um, and this one's really good. I think I'm gonna get a hot soy latte with sugar-free vanilla if they have it. And then we have to run to the store. You have to get what? Some like work clothes? Yeah. Wait, we're going then... to Soul Shot or the one up here? Because we're going this way to go to Tesco anyway. Soul Shot only has oat milk though. I'd rather get this one. Okay. And then we're gonna run to get some groceries. So I'll show you what we end up getting. We just need a few things like to get us through the week. Kinda, you know, I haven't had my coffee yet. Oh, I'm wearing my cute new skirt. I'll show you when I can actually like stand up and show you properly. I still feel like I'm wearing a fishbowl over my head. Still can't really hear. Or maybe it's your car. Can you hear okay? Yeah. Yeah, I just feel like one of those. It's already 11 a.m. Wow. A little late start. Everything I just was watching Rachel's vlog and I have her song stuck in my head. They're getting really popular. Yeah. Oh, cute dog. Are you What is the difference between flat white and a... Latte is served with steamed milk with an added layer of foamed milk on top. Flat white is topped by a very thin layer of steamed milk. I'll probably just get a flat white. Sure. With soy milk and then hopefully it's a sugar-free flavor. Go ahead Go and yourself. Do you guys have any sugar-free flavors? Uh, no. syrups? Yeah. No, they're not sugar-free. Okay. Afraid. Can I do a, um, a flat white, a small with soy milk? A soy milk flat white, yeah. yeah. Uh, anything else? else? No, that's it. No, nothing else? No. Don't carry it, is it? Yeah. <laughs> omelet. What's an omelet? Whatever you make. You smelled up the whole house. You smelled up the whole house. <clears throat> Why are you confused by that? Marshmallows. Perfect. Thanks very much. Thank you. Enjoy now. Thanks. She's got a latte with flavor. It's probably really hot. That is so good, though. Wow. They have good actual like espresso flavor. Yeah, like actual nice coffee. Yeah. Got it going on like Donkey Kong. I don't know why I have that song stuck in my head. Um, donkey Kong, but Donkey Kong. That BMW is always there. You it's think the they own it? Lives up by us. Mm -hmm. See, that would be something so fun to own something like that and like live right behind it and just like go there. Their family owns a lot of the things in the town. That makes sense. That makes sense why he has such a nice car too. I didn't bring my wallet though. No, you didn't because it's sitting on the on the wall by the chairs. back from the grocery store. I'll show you really quickly what we got. He got some pasta sauce. 
any more eggs. Actually, I'll set it all out and then show you. Okay. So which one do we got? Eggs, pasta sauce, chicken. I got tempeh, edamame, frozen berries for smoothies, and I like putting it in my oatmeal. Some cod, white fish, and then I found this like vegan chicken sweet chili, yum. And then just like vegan chicken pieces. And it had actually really clean ingredients, so I wasn't like mad at that. Then broccoli, cucumber, avocados, some oat milk for my coffee, and then he just took it away, but turkey burgers. <laughs> I just made my all-time favorite breakfast, even though it's 1 p.m. But it's oats. Ew, there's like... A serious spider web underneath here, I think. Okay. It's oats, just like quick oats. Maca powder, flax meal. Cook that in the microwave. And then I put a little bit of protein powder, dairy free Greek yogurt, frozen berries, because I like when they get all melty. And then my homemade mixed nut butter, which is absolutely so freaking good. And yeah, a good balanced breakfast. Mm. It's so yummy. It's a little cold. Guy's up on stage and he's just like selling it to me. I literally was about to go up the street and buy one of these bloody computers because about. Anyway, should we get on to today's episode? Friday. Let's start from the top. When I was in high school, it was only 50. What's up, my dudes? Just uh, doing the daily vlog and all that. Oh, look at this sunlight. It makes my. Uh, just looking hot. Why do you change the way you talk? Well, no, Jez, no. Uh, if you're talking like this, normal on the vlog, and uh, don't know why I don't talk like this. Because no one understands me. Look at this lazy couch. <laughs> I'm better at this shite than you are. <laughs> it's all over your shirt. Yeah, Crumbs. it's her fluff. Disgusting. Excuse me. Wait, can we do a story time of us getting pulled over again? Look, two birds are having sex. What? Where? We have a story time. Sorry, the lighting's better this way. So he's um, technically like a permit. So I have to be in the car with him to drive. And there was like a, what do you call it? The police were like doing a, a stop yeah, check to like check. Like taxes and stuff. Yeah, all your stuff. And then they yeah. have like on the car, you have to put an L for a learner so they know you're a learner. And so he was like, <clears throat> oh, do you have a full license? Do you have your permit thing? He didn't have it with him. But thankfully he had a picture of it. But long story short, I gave him my American license and he was like, um... Do you have an Irish one? And I was like, no. And then we were scared that he was going to get in trouble. But then basically everyone has never seen an American license here before. And they have never experienced this situation. So they kind of just like have to let us go. Because technically the Irish rules say like you need a full license. And I have a full license. Mm -hmm. It just doesn't specify you need a full Irish license. So he let us go. But it was scary. He like pulled us to the side and everybody was like, waiting behind us and I was like oh no we're gonna get in trouble but we didn't that story and then also I wanted to share this with you guys you're gonna be like seriously but if you want a way if you're not like educated already on like health nutrition or ingredient labels I downloaded this app I just got it and I'm already in love with it it's called trash panda um if it's bad I'm sorry you're like not accurate but I think it's pretty accurate for example, like if you're at the grocery store and you're like, oh, I don't really know what brand will be like the best for me, it'll tell you. So let's pick this. Okay, Purely Elizabeth Grain Free Pancake Mix. Oh, by the way, this is what it looks like. Trash Panda, like that, okay? And you can scan a barcode, so it's like really quick. Um, Purely Elizabeth Grain Free Pancake Mix, okay? 
and it has two exclamation marks and then one like yellow caution exclamation mark. So what it means, you can read. It'll say potentially harmful monocalcium phosphate and maltodextrin. Then you could click on them individually and it'll pull up like a report like this, okay? A report, health impact and what the issues are and then it even gives sources down there so you can read about it. So those are potentially harmful and then the yellow one, it's more like sugar, like coconut sugar was flagged in one and it was saying mm -hmm. how coconut sugar isn't bad but just don't overdo it because it's still sugar. So this one is gum, like all the gums, you know, thickening agents because those could be really bad on your digestive system. But isn't it so cool? So now you can look at like all the foods you're eating and like see because some of them are labeled or marketed as healthy and they're actually not. It's going to rot your insides out. Right. So I just wanted to share that if you are looking for some help. I need to scrub my tan off today, put on new tan, do a hair mask. Okay. You go, honey. I really want to do a face mask as well because I feel like my pores are getting clogged here. Mine are already clogged. Mm. So agree with me. We also have been watching um, Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Great well, show. He started it and now I just have to watch it because it's always on and it's fun no it actually is i love gina gina i think it's my favorite <clears throat> she reminds me of myself hilarious mm. yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. are there new episodes still coming out no how old is this oh. really i feel like it started a while ago but some of these things like they talked about covid didn't they? No. I don't know what the hell you're talking about, but you are fucking lost. Hey, yeah. First, li listen to this. I'm right. First episode was September 17th, 2013. Final episode. September 2021. That's not even a year ago. Smell yourself. Oh no, I already need a new memory card. Gosh darn it. Also, good news. Forgot. Oh. Forgot to mention no. this, my mom took her boards to be a fully licensed nurse practitioner and she passed. Yay! Now she can give me free drugs. Yeah. Oh, we need to email her. Mm -hmm. And I think I mentioned it's Sunday, July 31st and I go home Wednesday, August 10th. So I have like a week and a half left. Yay. Sad but happy. I'm really excited to go back to school. Yeah, I'm not. But we go to very different schools. I am and I am. I am and I am to play big back playing rugby in Ireland and the crack that has yeah. and stuff. The only thing that's going to stress me out is apartments and stuff. Yeah. You should do that right now a little. I can look on my computer. Yeah. Alright. We're going to go Bye. Look homeless men somewhere to live. Guys, we have Joanna, so if you're listening, we have an eating